Hey guys, welcome back more. Let's play Warrior on the Shake Dimension. Uh, I, <laughs> I forgot what to say for a second there. Uh, I'm Kali Kamara, the probable reason that you are here. And in the last episode, we tackled Launchpad Labyrinth of Jiggle Jungle. And in this episode, we are going to do Revoke Wrath Prints. But, uh, yeah, I haven't recorded in a while, so maybe this is why. But yeah, anyway, we're gonna do some... Do some... Revoke... Ra la Viva Blow Rapids. God. Jeez. Anyway, um... Yeah, Ripo River Boat Bloat Rapids. Jeez. Anyway, um, what you want to do here is finish before the clock hits 1.30, be the stage you are taking damage, collect 63,000 coins, defeat the golden enemy, feed 5 enemies to Venus Guy Traps, shake a turkey jerk, and beat the stage without falling into the water. Now, um, as per usual here, um, well not really as per usual, you can, on the first run, you can fall into the water fine. It's no real problem. Um, right, uh, let's see. Beware of the turkey jerk here. He is going to pound you. So, um, if you saw our mission objective, shake a turkey jerk, what you want to do it is down here. And there you go. Or you can get a handy coin bag in a handy nook. Excellent. Alright, beware though, because, uh, yeah, there's another turkey jerk up here. So just sort of throw him. Okay, uh, next up, we have this. Basically, you can feed... It, feed the, uh, enemy to the guy traps, just sort of by earth shaking, earth shake punching them, like, when they're above guy traps. Or you can, like, stun them, and then just... Here, I'll show you. You can do that. So yeah, pretty easy way to do it is to just leave this area and come back. It's always a useful way of doing things. Whoop, okay. Right, um, I find the most useful way of getting all the coins in this bag is just sort of going to this area here. And you should get most of the coins in there anyway. Right, yeah, I only missed out on 50 or so. Just nothing really. But yeah, uh. There you go. Five enemies. So. Over here, uh. There's an aggressive pitchfork. Not really anything to do with this guy, so all you want to do is really just kill him. Um. Oh, this bit. This bit is quite annoying, especially if you're going for, um. Uh, no damage as well. Because he'll do that. And then he'll do that, and like, most of the time you'll just run into an enemy or something like that. So yeah, um, it's a bit hard to get the turkey jerk alive, because, yeah, you've got to be pretty good with your timing. Like that. And then there's just like, these nose dozers and all that. There we go. Right. And we get another coin back, very nice. Okay, um, yeah, I'd, I don't really have much to talk about, really, anyway, I mean, I sort of ran out to run about, ran out of things to talk about, like, a while ago, because this Let's Play really has been dragging on for far too long. Yeah, it really should be finished by now, I don't know why I haven't done anything about it. But yeah, uh, up here is the first treasure, and it is called... A Venus Guy Trap Seed. Very nice. Not really very nice for the person who's gonna, you know, get eaten by it, but you know what I mean. Whoa! Shoot. Yeah. Yeah. I think you pro guys probably know this already, but if you get caught in a Guy Trap, just shake. Shake the uh, Wii Remote to get out. It's not really that all that hard. Okay, um... Right, I guess guess what, what we want to do here is do this. Let's go over here. Um. All right, let me think about this. Kill him definitely because we're gonna land on him knowing my luck. Now we gotta do it again. Right. So we just wait for this guy. 
wait for him to die, and then we get diamond. Very nice. Okay, good. Hang on, I'm just gonna... Okay, there we go. Whoa! You, sir, should die. I'm gonna watch you die. Thank you. Lovely. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, the only only thing really I can talk about is just sort of the game in general, really. I mean, I'm not Chugga Conroy, I don't come up with, like, stories a minute. I'm not. I've been doing this for a year, but... I'm not what you call experienced. I'm not skilled at commentary. I'm not bad, but... I'm, yeah. Anyway, we're just gonna get this dash right here. Um, do that. Jump up there. Whoops. Okay. Yeah, I'm not even enthusiastic about this anymore. I'm just oopsie. I didn't do that on purpose. Haha. <laughs> Cheesy voice. Whatever. Okay. So anyway, you want to jump just sort of like late-ish around like this part here, so that you're not gonna jump off the edge or jump too early. Because um. If you just jump off the edge, if you just fall off the edge, then you'll just like hit the rope and it's, yeah, not fun. Anyway, um, yeah, there you go. Nice little uh, diamond and stuff. Okay, whatever. Uh, so we're gonna want to activate all the guy traps this time. Uh, that was clever. Um, I really shouldn't have done that. Great. All right. Um, not to worry. Uh, sure, we'll be fine. And what's a couple of coin bags in here? Right. Um, do I want to? You know, what? I f I think I do. Uh, yeah, right here. This is fine. It's low ceiling. It's quite convenient. Okay. Whoa, hey buddy. Right, uh now leads to the next area, so you can see the golden enemy up there, and uh Right. Yeah, I broke that one, okay, great. Right. Um So what you want to do here is just sort of run across them. Jump, turn around, jump off, jump up. Okay. It, it's a bit difficult because the timing is off when you're just tripping with the guide traps endlessly. It's really annoying. And sometimes you mistime it. But eventually you'll get it. Hopefully I can do this right, actually, because uh, it's quite rewarding when you do. Yeah, there we go. Okay, just keep jumping. Getting off here. Hopefully you should be able to do that, yeah. Okay. That way you can shake the golden enemy for coins. Which is very useful when you're trying to get the coin goal. And now we just kill it. Hurrah. Not kill the golden enemy, sorry. You have to defeat the golden enemy. It's like Pokemon. They don't die, they faint. Anyway, um... Harmful area if you're going for no damage because spikes around. But yeah, um... What you want to do here is just break that block and just start flim farm dashing. Uh, right. Um, how do I do this again? Oh yeah, I remember now. Um, so what you want to do is just jump on him, jump on him, do that, drop off, jump off him, hit that. And jump off again, and there you go. Now you're free another flim flim flam. Um, okay, what you want to do here is jump that, jump that, jump. Uh, I did that wrong. Okay, not to worry. Let's wait for them to close again, or open rather. Um, all right, let's go. Let's do this again. Jump off him and hit that wall. 
jump off the closed guy traps, jump off the wall, hit him, and there you go. Now for an emerald melon, which I'm sure is a very good treasure. It's like crystallized pineapple. I don't even know what that is. Crystallized pineapple, I don't know whether it's a food or it's just like jewelry or whatever. Why am I talking about crystallized pineapple? It's weird. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> right. Okay, so uh, let's go on a slam here, I guess. And there we go. Okay. Because usually the boundaries in the area will block the coins from actually going anywhere, so. Why not belly flop there? Um, okay, whatever. Um, Alright, just jump off these in quick succession. And you'll reach a coin back. Very nice. Uh, yeah, nose doors are here. You may want to clear that out before jumping down, because they are more than likely to hit you. Jokes that they are. Whatever. Okay. Best way to shake it would be here, really. So we'll do just that. Alright, good. Alright, I think that's everything we have to do here. Just checking. Yeah, yeah, I suppose it is. Not really anything. Okay, fun. It's fun by me. Surprised I remember this place. I did practice, but um, I have this problem of not actually remembering the area. So yeah. Okay. Ah, it's going fairly smoothly so far. If I do see so myself. Myself. Right. Uh, tell you what you can do. You can do this. There you go. Um, that's a pin plan. Okay. Uh, get that. Jump up there. Jump up there. Jump that. They just sort of die. Okay. Warp pipe. Oh, this warp pipe. This warp pipe's interesting. What you want to do here? Do not break the wooden logs. They are essential for this. Uh, what you want to do is do this. Uh, I'm pretty sure I've just done that wrong. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you want to hit. You want to hit that wall first because uh, it's crucial to this. That way you'll get free, like free wall, free wall touches, and then you'll get over here, which is where you need to be. But anyway, you get a diamond, and also a secret map, and another objective. Hooray! Free at once. I like that. That's good. Mm. But yeah, with the coin sorted out, uh, we should be okay. Excellent. So we're looking at all treasures. Um, coin goal, um, the guy trap the goal, the golden enemy, and the turkey jerk goal as well. So I think we'll only be needing one more run through this area after this one. Okay, so just wanted to do this jumping log thing again. Dash jumps are quite useful for this area anyway, so um, yeah, make sure you use them. Right, that's a gold coin bag. Uh, oh yeah, do not drop down from this ledge, because otherwise you will land in the water and you will lose the coin bag. Believe me, I know. And I lost the coin. I lost the coin gold because of that, and I had to do the whole stage again. Believe me, it's not the best thing to do. This is a very bad idea. Okay. Uh, oh yes, I remember now. Uh, I remember what I need to do. Uh, what I need to do is this. What you want to do, rather, is uh, run off this, hit this wall, hit this wall, and then run into this area. Because then you will do that. No, I do not want to do that. Do that, yeah. And hit that. And there you go. The third treasure is... A muscle man suit, which is 
kind of weird, but whatever. <laughs> I'll, I'll take it. And I just did that. Yeah, I just did that. I did that! You don't know what it is, but I did that. Well, yes, you do, but... Shut up. Whatever, um, uh, just hit the checkpoint and get ready to do it. Get ready to hit that, es get ready to escape! Couldn't get the words out, because I'm stupid. Right, uh, get to the bottom of this rope and swing into here. A good idea is to... I don't know what a good idea is to do, but, uh, just jump up here. And just jump all the gaps, really. Yeah, you're shooting for time in this, by the way, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> Be wary. What's the time goal again? 130. Okay, great. Okay. Okay, good, I like that. Um. Okay, good. I did that pretty well, actually. Uh, ah. Whoa, okay. Jump there. Damn, I screwed it. Uh, well, maybe not. Maybe, maybe we can get this. Oh, get out of the way. Seriously. I'm not in the mood. Uh, okay. Uh, crap, no. Okay, whatever. I was gonna say I was doing very well up to this point, but then I failed, so... Yeah, what you want to do is just sort of run down here, run through the water. Because that's the best way you're gonna get through here. Uh, duck, yeah. Uh... And there you go! That's how to easily beat the time challenge. Easily, mind. <laughs> because, uh... Yeah. It's hard! I'm just saying. But yeah, um, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to meet you back at the escape run, because, um, yeah, it's really not hard to go through the stage without taking damage, and or falling into the water, really. Just be careful. That's all you really need to do. Alright, uh, see you guys at the escape run. Okay, um, yeah, I managed to get here without taking damage or falling into the water, so... All you really need to do here is just sort of take a safe route through here. It's not really hardest of things to do. Yeah. Just go for it. <laughs> yeah, not really much you can say about it, really. Even if you fail, as long as you don't uh, fall into the water, you're fine. You're good. So yeah, not really much to talk about. I mean, I'm, I'm all set to finish this game, anyway. Let's see, uh... Again. Yeah, there we go. Alright, okay. Uh, that's not a bad way of doing it, actually. Could do that. Probably take a load of time, though. I have not been one for timing before. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay. I was scared for a second there. Right. Let's just get out of here. As they say, let's skedaddle. Uh, so let's just ride a log. Uh, yeah, that that was a stupid thing to say. <laughs> right, whatever. Let's just go in. There you go. Beat the stage without taking damage or falling into the water. Very nice. Okay. And with that, that pretty much marks the end of... Riverboat, river bloat rapids. I, I used to call it riverboat rapids. It's easier to say. River bloat rapids. Riverboat blah, blah, blah. Mm, Whatever. Anyway, uh, yeah. That's the end of the end of this episode. Um, yeah. Next time on Let's Play Warrior on the Shake Dimension, we will be stuck. Oh no! Damn it! I hate that. I we we are going to do. My most hated stage of all time. I hate this stage. This is the worst stage in the game, in my opinion. And we'll be doing that next episode, alright? And I probably won't practice for it, because I want to get it over with, alright? Whatever. Just see you guys then.